the city of PAE, managing our stormwater is the most important way we can prevent flooding whenever it rains, especially in residential areas. We manage stormwater from right around Adelaide, not just from within PAE, as it all flows through here on its way out to the sea. Much of our stormwater infrastructure is hidden underground, and although you can't see it, we have over 550 kilometres of stormwater channels and pipes, 90 detention basins, 4,000 pits and over 10,000 inlets, not to mention the countless pumps and mechanical systems. I'm here in Largs Bay to show you one of our current projects to build new outlet pipes on the foreshore. Whenever it rains, we need to ensure that the stormwater running off the roofs of our houses, paved areas and roads keeps flowing to prevent flooding. Our infrastructure includes entry pits, underground pipes and detention basins to control the flow of stormwater. Much of our underground infrastructure was built more than 50 years ago, which means that it's coming towards the end of its useful life. We also need to upgrade the infrastructure in areas of PAE where there is new, higher density living. This is a massive investment and is very complex work, which is why it's happening over a 20 year period. Recently at Birkenhead Naval Reserve we installed larger underground piping, a new pump station and a large detention basin. Meanwhile at Dover Street in Blair Athol we've just finished installing underground stormwater pipes, retaining walls, rockwork, irrigation and turf. At the same time we've revitalised the open spaces in both reserves providing new areas in which to relax and play. We know from in-depth flood modelling that areas of the peninsula are flood prone. Currently we are upgrading the existing drainage system in this area and extending the drain along Military Road. Work has already begun in the foreshore car park and will progress toward Weekly Street. And the budget for this project is $1 million. When it's finished we'll work with the rest of the upgraded system across the peninsula to protect the area even during rare peak flooding events. During construction you can expect some delays and traffic detours, but we'll try to minimise the impact as much as possible. Because the pipe system conflicts with the existing sewers and water mains, there will be times when SA water is also involved. Upgrading the stormwater infrastructure is a major commitment from the council. We'll be undertaking this over the next 20 years. In all, the program will total over $171 million. The work includes deep excavation, sandy soil conditions and traffic management. We also need to factor in the proximity of our stormwater infrastructure to gas, water, sewer, Telstra and NBN infrastructure. We're undertaking extensive community consultation throughout our stormwater infrastructure work. Check out our Have Your Say page where you can provide feedback and keep up to date with all our projects. You can also read updates on our website, social media platforms, or give us a call at any time to chat about our stormwater.